Okay, so here's the portrait of Pirates Maximum Do Flamingo. I've been waiting for them to make a Dress Rosa Do Flamingo ever since I started collecting. So I was really excited when they finally announced this. And I've seen like so many videos of him on YouTube, but seeing him in person, he's just even bigger than he looks in the videos and more impressive. It's just amazing. His face looks spot on. It's just, I think, the perfect Do Flamingo figure. Yeah, so the rocks are kind of rubbery. Then so is his coat. And it comes with this um, little pole to help keep him from leaning, I guess. Just put it right there like that. I was pretty annoyed when I first saw that it was coming with this, but it just looks so good that I don't really care at this point. Initially I was a little worried this wouldn't look as good as it does because I had seen a picture someone posted before it officially released. Someone posted some pictures of one and his, his mouth, well his face but around his mouth looked a little off so I was thinking maybe they messed it up but seeing it now that I have one looks just like the just like the official pictures did. It's got to be the best Do Flamingo figure. I really love how they did the shoes and then, of course, the hair on his legs. And the pants look amazing, also. You can even see his fingernails. Yeah, so the face is just absolutely perfect on this. And yeah, I couldn't be happier with it. Got the veins on his forehead. And then, from any angle, it looks perfect. It looks just like him. The whole, the whole head sculpt is just perfect. I think that's pretty much the most important thing to me when picking a figure, is that it looks like the character. If it doesn't capture the character's likeness, then... There's no point in me getting the figure. I've even picked um, some prize figures over Portrait of Pirates figure just because the prize figure they look more like the actual character. So, yeah, that's the most important thing. So I can't even remember the last time I've been this impressed and excited about a figure. And I got like four new Portrait of Pirates figures this month. I opened most of them yesterday, but I still got one more to open maybe. But yeah, you know. They're good, as usual, but this one's just like a step above. He's just amazing. 
See, I'll turn them around and look at the coat now. Why is it this color down here? Doesn't make any sense. I um, still love the figure, but that's probably my only problem with it is this weird coloring they do. But, yeah, and also up here, you can see got little yellow tips there on the coat. Like, what is it supposed to be? The light shining from his hair or something doesn't I don't care for it here he is with the version 2 gear 4 I was gonna display them like this together but I ended up displaying them both facing forward but I think they look good like this also so maybe at some point I'll put them like this um, but yeah right now I have them both facing forward I also wanted to I really like the the way this Luffy looks in the back. So I also might display them like this. Let's see. Actually, they do look pretty good like this if I go up at a higher angle. So maybe if I put them on a lower shelf and put them just like this, I'll display them like this. And here he is with the first Gear 4 figure. It's the first time I've seen them together. I just got them out right now. Um, I really like how they look together. Let's see how they look um, facing each other. So here's how I have them set up. I just added the original bound man up there after filming the video. Not sure, not sure if I'm gonna leave him or not, but yeah, here's my setup right now. I'm actually redoing all my shelves, but they're not all finished yet. Maybe I'll make a video once they're done if anyone wants to see that. This is easily one of my favorite Portrait of Pirates figures. I was waiting years for them to make um, Doflamingo from Dressrosa and they finally did it and it's even better than I could have imagined so extremely happy with it. Yeah it's definitely even even more impressive in person than it looks on video so if you want to get it I definitely try to get it now before it's completely gone everywhere. It's pretty close to gone everywhere already now. Not sure where you can still get it. Uh, I think there's a few places though. But yeah, it's just my favorite Doflamingo figure, one of my top Portrait of Hearts figures.